What's going on, everybody? We're back. Uh, this is part two of our Resident Evil 4 playthrough. We're just, you know, chilling with our boy still in this cave. Um, if you've been following along, uh, we basically just went through, like, the first main part of the game. Uh, collected some blue medallions, all that good stuff, and now we're in this cave with our, our amigo Welcome. here. Welcome. Uh, we just bought the TMP. Got some rare things. We know, bud. We know, stranger. What are you buying? Um, yeah, we don't have any money left. But we Come just bought the TMP. At any time. Which is quite crucial. And it's one of the only weapons that you're going to get, at least that I'm going to get, that I'm going to keep. Because eventually, the pistol, you're going to find a better version of the pistol. Um, the sniper and the shotgun, so... For now, we will just try and save as much money as we can, but we will also be investing into the TMP. Bird nest right there. Now we're in the creepy graveyard. Hate this graveyard. Not a big fan. But this is also where the uh, blue medallions are that we need. So, we will be getting a free thing pretty soon. Which is cool. Oh, yeah. Combine that. Don't forget to combine your things. That is for sure. Yeah, look at this TMP. Pumped about this. TMP has tons of ammo, too, so you can, like, pop one bird at a time. Which is nice. No, you know, don't underestimate the birds. I see this creepy guy, but other than that, I don't really see anyone else trying to come kill me. Unless there's someone behind me. Nope, oh, no one behind me. <laughs> God, this game creeps me out. Ah! This lady. Get TMP'd. Damn. Barely affected her. She barely flinched. <laughs> yeah, come at me, boy. Stay. Yeah, that's right. Save some ammo. There's a little hut back here. Some items in it. There's a snake in one of these boxes. I know there is. I think it's this one. Let's see if we can, uh... No snake. Okay. Well, there's snakes in boxes sometimes. <laughs> uh, Grab this medallion. Oh, come on, Leon. Come on. Come on. There it is. Bam. I thought there was one over here. Yeah, one right there. Come on. Come on. Oh, dude, it's so hard with a <laughs> pistol sometimes. Alright. And there's one right there. So, you know what? We're just going to whip this out. Just make life a little easier. Bam. And now we got ten. I wonder now if we can go actually talk to the stranger and see if he's going to give us what he's going to give us. Because I think we only need 10. That's what he said. So we might as well check. We'll check really quick. Because if so, we can probably upgrade some of our other guns. Uh, Welcome! Got some rare things... So you shot more than ten medallions. Yeah. What are you selling? Nothing. What are you buying? buying? Yes, the Punisher. So, if we compare this with this, I wonder <laughs> yes, what the difference thank you. is. What are you buying? Handgun. Doo -doo 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 -doo. So 1.0, 1.73, 10.47. Punisher, you can't even. Come back. Upgrade. 
I don't remember what the difference time. is. But I don't think you really want the Punisher. So, I usually sell it back to him. Sure. What are you selling? Punisher, yeah. So it's a free 10 grand. Oh, okay, so we can see the stats here. Wow, that was hard before. Yeah, there's really no real difference between them. This one's just worth more to sell, I think. Ah, I... <laughs> so, Thank yeah, you. we'll free up that space in our case. And hey, we got some Monet now. But we won't quite spend it yet. We don't really need to. But yeah, 10 medallions. Get you the Punisher. I'm not sure if getting all 15 gets you something or not. I can't remember, but <clears throat> we will get them anyways. That lady and that dude are still dead, which is cool. Sorry, I'm walking over all these people's graves. Sorry, people. Ah, yes, no. And these these blokes just hanging out. These cool guys. Yep, the guy with the dynamite. <laughs> Always trying to shoot the dynamite. I know it's easier said than done, but. Very good. Another bird's nest. Ooh, a little grenade. It's pretty uh ridiculous for a bird. Pretty sure you can come around here. Maybe, maybe, uh, maybe not. Yeah. Well, there's a blue medallion right here. Another one. Is there one in here? Nope. Yeah, I can't remember where they all are. This door's locked. There's more enemies back here. Puzzle. Hmm. So we're gonna go three, 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 four, 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 and then. Finally, three. Voila! And that's our green cat sign. So, if we look at our key treasures, green cat sign, red cat sign, and I'm pretty sure they go in here. Oh, maybe not. Did these go in here? Yeah, they go in the stein. And I think there's one more cat site we're going to need to get. So, like I said, combine these items, they're going to sell for much more than they would normally. So I think there's a blue cat site, and that's the last thing we need. Yeah, so we're doing our thing. Um, we can't go in this building. Round hole, something fits in here. On again, it's Leon. The door's locked. I can't get in. Didn't they teach you how to pick locks at the academy? Yeah. There's some sort of indentation, like something might fit inside. Well, there's no use standing around. Leon, you have to find some way or something to get inside. Oh, we doing it. We getting in here. Don't you worry. We're coming for you, Ashley. Uh, oh, yeah. This... Just, uh, gotta stay strapped, you know. Gotta stay strapped around these parts. Yeah, these dudes are pretty easy to dig up. Alright, so, a couple other blue medallions we need to get. The 
this guy right there, and there's that guy down there. You can kind of see in the distance, so. I'm just gonna use my, my rifle. And my fancy scope. Which this is still kind of hard. I usually, like, try and not touch the stick and just wait for the crosshair to, like, line up. But it's, it's tough. Come on. Come on. Pretty tough one. There we go. Jump over. Turn around. Uh, one right here. So that's 14 out of 15. Definitely a snake in one of these boxes, I promise you. Not crazy. Yep, oh, there he is. Bastard. Not gonna get me. Not today. Closure of the church. Yeah, we know. Toad's gonna eat that egg. last blue guy is, unless I missed him out in the field. Man, like five headshots. Okay, yeah, I'm definitely missing one of the blue uh, medallions. Hmm. Investigate. That is for sure. Can't leave y'all hanging. Probably overlooked one. Let's see. None up in the trees. None on the buildings. There's definitely none up there. Nope. It's somewhere around these parts. I forget where. <laughs> Not in here. Got the one over there. I don't think there's one over here. Unless we missed it in the last part. Oh, what a bird's nest I missed. Yeah, I don't know. Missed one. <laughs> Sorry, people. Yeah, definitely missed one. Uh, definitely, I think it's probably back in the uh, first section. But I know, I swear we got all the ones in the first section. Just looking around the outskirts for anything looking looking blue. But I don't see it. Hmm. Yeah, who knows? I'll have to look back at that. Figure it out. Yeah. Hmm. Unless there's something I missed back here, which I don't think there is. Ah ha! There it is. It's on the side of the building. I knew it. I knew it. Not gonna leave y'all hanging. Bam! 15 out of 15. I was so distracted by the puzzle. I think that's why they put one put one there, so the, you'll overlook it. Ain't gonna get me Resident Evil 4. Yeah, it's really, it's really been, it's been over a year since I think I did a full playthrough on this game, but I originally played it on GameCube. Remember, that was the first experience with it, and then I mainly played it on PS2, and then when it came out for Xbox in the Microsoft Store, I bought it for my Xbox, I beat it on Xbox, so. It's been a lot of time with this game, that's for sure. Still, can't remember everything. Look at all damn birds. And if you're smart, you'll have saved a flash grenade. I am. 
Look at all that bird money. Let's go on all these houses, get all these items. Out here there's some items. Hmm, that sounds great. That doesn't sound scary at all. Like they have a dragon. Drogon from Game of Thrones is just chilling. Creepy. Yeah, fuck your boxes. <laughs> this place seems sketchy, but it's actually cool. This is a safe area. Go around back here. There's that infamous blue fire. Tons of ammo to pick up, but whenever you see that blue fire, you know our friend's nearby. Hello, stranger. Got some rare things on sale, stranger. What are you buying? Uh need the map? Should we get the map? I feel like that'd be a waste. But... Eh. Let's do some you shit. What are you Um... This pistol sucks, man. <laughs> Honestly, I'm gonna hold off on the pistol. I'm gonna hold off on the pistol. Um... Really, TMP? Uh, Is that old? <laughs> reload speed, <laughs> rifle. You. Rifle reload speed sucks too. Having that boost in capacity though Is does free up some space. So, <laughs> Thank all right, you. yeah, I'm not gonna waste anything on the pistol. All right, our case is getting pretty full. I got tons of shotgun ammo. Save it out. Oh. Remember, always save. Saving is so crucial. Now the crate. Over here, there's a bunch of fish, but you can't really get them yet, so. Don't worry about them. And this is going to be another one of those life or death smash some buttons moment. So, gotta get limber, gotta get ready, gotta stretch out for this one. Alright. Anytime you see that with the skulls, you know you're fucked. Alright, here we go. I almost missed that, because sometimes it's the shoulders but shoulder button, sometimes it's A plus B, and you don't know. Whoo! I was so close. I was ready to squeeze them triggers. <laughs> okay, we made it. And now, there's just mad people we gotta kill. Well, this is also a pretty straightforward area. It's just chilling by this dynamite. Here. Yeah, that's why I really like the rifle. Let you kind of be stealthy and strategic. And it helps you save a bunch of your other ammo. There's also some peeps over here, I believe.
This creepy fella. Got the dynamite and his head. <laughs> All in one shot. Another creepazoid in here. Ah, oh, fuck. I need to sway with him. <laughs> there we go. Alright, so we're shredding through all of our uh, rifle ammo. We have a ton of shotgun ammo, so I think I'm just going to finish this off with a shotgun. Uh, we killed uh, almost everyone, honestly. There might be one or two more people in this area. There you go, there's one. <laughs> ah, snake! Oh, he got me. Son of a bitch. There's one. Hi, friend. Un forastero! Yeah. Come here, boy. He just blew himself up. <laughs> That snake <laughs> for biting me. <laughs> yeah, she get for biting me. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Didn't realize there's something more. Oh god! Oh god! There's way more people than I thought. Stayo, or whatever you say. Got you this time. Yeah, fuck. All right, keep on moving. Ticker. My poor ticker. I'm getting all stressed out. Oh, yeah, this little spot up here. Oh, we hear our dog. Uh, nope, nothing on this wood. Policia, policia! Yep, that's the body of the dude that brought me here. Ah, <laughs> oh, the worst. Ah, oh, giant lake monsters are the worst. 
Ah. I hate him. I hate him so much. Leon's like, fuck. I gotta deal with this. Mm. That yellow. That good, good, you know. Definitely hit up this typewriter. Oh, what up? That good, good. Bam. Typewriting it up. And you know, why not go out onto the sketchy lake? with the big sketchy uh, lake monster. Why not do that? Seems like a fun time. Let's try not to die, Leo. Get some water donuts while we can. Do we water donuts? Oh, well, let's go fishing. Bears! Ah! Jesus. Scared the shit out of me when I was like 12. <laughs> Alright. I hate this thing. I hate it so much. So, so much. It tries to drag you into these like big floaty things. Don't let them. Dive, swerve out of the way. Gain your bearings. Oh god. Let's see, I let myself hit the boat. What are you doing, Leon? It's just like afraid to eat your boat. <laughs> Right in the ass. First death, and it's usually by this thing. Oh, this thing sucks. Damn. I done spilled my drink. Just kidding. Didn't spill any coffee. Ah, oh, alright. Rip run. Rip run. Let's try again. Let's try again. Try, try, try again. <laughs> Didn't mean to press that. Get in there, Leon. I know you're terrified, so am I. We know, we know. Get hit by the fangs. Things. Yeah, the play very uh, 
defensively. Make sure I don't get knocked off this friggin' boat. Yeah. Take it to that ass. Through this part, I should say. Alright, we made it. We survived. Fuck that boss. <laughs> I'll say it. I said it before, I'll say it again. Fuck that boss. Horrifying. Ugh. Oh, oh no, Leah. You have stomach ulcers. Cough that blood. We survived, but Leon's kind of jacked up at the moment. Kind of jacked up. Don't die, Leon. Don't die. Oh no. Dude, if I looked down at my arm and saw that shit, I'd be like, well, just just shoot me. Twas all a dream. It was all a dream. Leon. S. Kennedy. Leon, it's been six hours since our last transmission. I was starting to get worried. Don't you mean lonely? Anyway, I started to feel dizzy, and then I guess I must have lost consciousness. Lost consciousness? Maybe that has some connection to what the village chief was talking about. Hmm. Can't say. But I'm all right now. I'm going to continue my mission. <laughs> I'm all right now. <laughs> yeah, but... <laughs> like, didn't even mention the giant, like... Lake worm, you just had to defeat. Anonymous letter. There's an important item hidden in the falls. If you're able to get it, you might be able to get Ashley out of the church. But I'll warn you the route to the church isn't a walk in the park by any means. They've deployed what's called an El Gigante, so God bless. 
about what's been going on in your body. If I could help you, I would. But unfortunately, it's beyond my power. Thank you, mysterious individual. Oh no, swing and a miss. Okay, just gonna hit this typewriter again. I know we just saved, but hey, we can save us those cutscenes, you know. Ah. Alright, so, we need to go in that direction with the torches, obviously. But, before we do that... Uh, oh, just checking back here, make sure there's nothing I'm missing. Ooh, and actually, pardon, real quick. I gotta uh, plug in my headphones because they're gonna die. I thought I was gonna die during that uh that boss fight, and I was gonna be so upset because I couldn't be able to hear anything. All right, uno momento. Really gotta get me some uh, hard wired ones, I suppose. I mean, I don't know. I like having wireless headphones, but these ones die all the time. Granted, these are like five or six year old turtle beaches that I used with my Xbox forever. Okay. Alright, we're plugged. My head's now connected to the to an outlet, so that's always whew, that's always good. Alright. So we look at all these fish. If only I had room for these fish. Alright, we're gonna get on this boat. And oh, uh, what's this? Some blue lights. Our friend has set up shop somewhere, so let's go uh, hang out with him for a little bit. Oh, yeah, dude, I don't know how this dude gets round, but he gets round, let me tell you. There's also tons of good hidden items here. Uh, not really hidden, I should say, but there's a means to getting them. But it's pretty straightforward. Free money, free ammo. All about that life. So, we can take this green gem and combine it with this mask. Combining things. Oh yeah, and then finally you, I think you can just, oh yeah, you can just hop down into his shop. <laughs> Pretty sure. Can I not hop down here? I thought you could hop down. Oh yeah, there we go. Hello, stranger. <laughs> Ooh, need some room for this rifle ammo, that's for sure. I will sacrifice two TMP ammos. But yeah, we're uh, we're pretty full, so. Gotta start killing some people. Using some of these grenades, honestly. A shit ton of grenades. Hello, stranger. What are you selling? So we got two flash, two hand grenades, two incinerators. Hmm. Is that all? So one <laughs> hand grenade. Thank you. See, green, red, yellow, worth 10k. But we do need all the yellows we can get, so we won't sell that. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> sell these spells. Thank you. That's really it. What are you buying? What are you buying? Um, yeah, screw it. We'll upgrade the shotgun. Why not? We're gonna, we're gonna need to. 
Okay, get the capacity up to eight, hold some more. But honestly, the firepower is not that is great. Is that so. old? <laughs> Thank you. All right. Yeah, we're getting to the point where I'm going to need to start upgrading weapons, so. But, fortunately, you can sell weapons back to this guy, obviously, so. And the more upgraded it is, the better money you get, so. Doesn't really matter. You get your money back, usually. In most instances, but. Yeah, so I'll definitely be doing this first playthrough, and then I'll definitely be doing a second playthrough, of course. Um, and eventually get to a point where we have almost all the extra special weapons. Which I'm pretty sure in the GameCube version is the same as the PS2 version. And you know what? I know this is going to seem a little crazy. Just because we went across the lake and in case we die, I'm just going to save one more time. Yep, save way too often. I'll usually, I'll probably put on like 70 or 80 saves in a single playthrough. I think that's usually how it works out. This guy. Brain stem. Oh god. Oh god. I am. Kick. Watch out for that hook thing, because it can literally chop your head off. Got a case of them plagas. Oh my god, the amount of ammo. Uh, we're getting, I think we're getting pretty close to where I can get the next, pi like the pistol I really like to use. So then we can just upgrade. That's why I don't want to dump any money into this thing, so. I'm being stubborn about it. So a few things before we even jump down from here. Gonna want to shoot them chains. And you're gonna wanna shoot them chains. Which I totally missed, but it gave it to me anyways. And you're gonna wanna shoot. Two chains, just good. Um, you look down, see this lovely gentleman. Shooting right in the ass. Spindles. I don't think I'm missing anything. Alright, and we're gonna jump across, jump across, jump across, jump 
grounds. No grounds. Gotta get those cogs moving. Let's climb up here. Bang that switch. Okay, and now that we've done that, we're gonna have some company. So, jump down, get ready to fight. I'll show you my strategy. I usually jump over, and I turn right the fudge back around. <laughs> and I make them come to me. <laughs> okay, so you can't get us to our left, they can only jump across. <laughs> Easiest way to do it. I mean, you don't get any of the items that they drop, which kind of sucks. But hey, we saved ourselves a bunch of ammo. And it was pretty funny. Come across, another shiny guy, pretty obvious. Amber green. Good to like look in case there's like little indents and shit because you never know you might find an item in the wall. There we go. Here's the key we need to get us into the church. I've obtained an object that resembles a cult group's insignia. Wonderful, Leon. Head back to the church. Ashley's safety is our immediate priority. Okie dokie. Artichoke. Grab us some more free money. These bats are pretty, uh, pretty dope. Another random boat. How convenient. And what do you know? We're back here. Pop a quick save. Um, yeah, I don't think it's really worth seeing him again. And this is going to be a good fight. Dude, this 
so gnarly. <laughs> what a way to go. Mierda. <laughs> Great. Here we go. Legs. Yeah, I'm definitely rusty. Haven't done this in a little while. Our dog. Our friend Dog. Remember how I told you don't be an asshole, save that dog in part one? That's why you save this dog. Because he's a true G. He goes, hey, don't hurt my friend. He helped me. Bye, El Gigante. You are dead as hell, sir. Alright, grab this Monet. For sure. Um, we're gonna use this just because I want to use this yellow. And because there's some more herbs over here. Another yellow herb. Yes, yeah, so we're slowly but surely increasing our health. Alright, we're gonna organize a little bit just for my own sanity. Apparently I can't. Um, yeah, still I guess the most ammo I have is in my pistol, so... Uh. Ooh, got some TMP, nice. Yeah, pre-loading, pre-reloading, I should say, is uh, so important. I know it's tedious, I know I do it a bunch, but it's very important. I think this is the way I gotta go? Yeah, yeah, that's totally the way I gotta go. Um, I could go back and save, but you know what? Feeling ballsy. We're gonna go for it. Oh yeah, we're back out here. Some Monet. Um, watch out for these super scary dogs. Oh wow, he's just like stone cold, not even. Oh god. But he's got friends. 
It goes against everything I believe in shooting a dog in the face, but these are not regular dogs. Super scared dogs. Sacrifice one bullet. Yeah, case management. Crazy. Alright, here we go. Going into the church. Mierda. Stealing the priest's money. It's time for a little puzzle. So, can't get over this way, so you gotta jump. line up right so that's what you want for red I think that's what you want for green yep and blue Is that? And then you combine them. Ooh, nailed it! Nailed it! First try. Yep. And now this unlocks this door. And guess who it is? Ashley. Hey, Straight take it easy. Matrix that shit. No! Get away! Calm down. Everything's going to be just fine. My name's Leon. I'm under the president's order to rescue you. What? My father? That's right. And I have to get you out of here. Now come with me. The president's daughter. Oh, God. Frickin' Ashley. Leon! All right, it's Leon. It. I've succeeded in extricating my subject. Good work, Leon. I'll send a chopper over right away. Where's the extraction point? There's another trail that you can take to get out of the village. The chopper will pick you up beyond there. Got it. I'm on my way. <laughs> There's a trail. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that's how you control her. That works. Yep, so Ashley is pretty much useless. <laughs> you, you get to play as her for a small portion of this game, but other than that, she's basically something you have to worry about, but there's different ways to uh, make it so it's not that bad, but yeah, not that great. Not that great of a companion. Wait, follow me, wait, follow me, wait, follow me. That's basically it. <laughs> wait. Follow me. And she doesn't know how to use ladders. Yeah. <laughs> it's brutal. I'll take the girl. Who are you? If you must know, my name is Osman Sadler, the master of this fine religious community. What do you want? To demonstrate to the whole world our astounding power, of course. 
No longer will the United States think they can police the world forever. So, we kidnap the President's daughter in order to give her our power, and then send her back. No! Needle Come neck. On. I think they shot something in my neck. Neck needles. What did you do to her? What we did you do? We planted her a little gift. Oh, there's going to be one hell of a party when she returns home to her loving father. <laughs> but before that, I thought I might bargain with the president for some donation. Believe it or not, it takes quite a lot of money to keep this church up and running. Faith in money will lead you nowhere, Sadler. Oh, I believe I forgot to tell you that we gave you the same gift. When I was unconscious. Oh, I truly hope you like our small but special contributions. When the eggs hatch, you will become my puppets. Involuntarily, you'll do as I say. I'll have total control over your minds. Don't you think this is a revolutionary way to promulgate one's faith? Sounds more like an alien invasion if you ask me. You okay? Uh, Leon, what's gonna happen to us? Don't worry. We got into this mess, we can get out of it. Uh. End of the chapter. End of chapter 2 2. Or 2 1. Yeah. Well, I think that's a good, uh, good way to end part 2 here. On that note. So, man, that was a lot of fun. We finally got Ashley back. We're making progress on our guns, doing big things. Man, look forward to part three. Um, if you haven't already, please subscribe. Um, hit the notification bell. You'll see more of my videos. Um, if you, Since you made it to this part of the video, you're the shit. I say it every time. Really appreciate you. Um, and yeah, till next time. Peace.